I am back my beautiful ladies and gems and today I am going for this look here it is a smoky eye a la Tracy from Jerseylicious her famous double wing <laughs> so for all my Jerseylicious fans if you want to find out how to get Jerseylicious vibe that's a good word to use like this then please keep watching so for time's sake I have already primed my eye I used the elf eyelid primer and I based my eye with the cream shadow Revlon cream shadow quad use this white one there and I put that just on the lid primed from lash line up to brow bone we are going to take a small flat shader brush like this and we are going to put it into this light bronzy color from the uh, Coastal Sand 88 palette and we're going to go ahead and put that all over the lid we're going to take this light camel color with like a little bit of shimmer in it with the same shader brush and we're just going to put that right over the light bronze color that we started with any color that is like your skin tone with a fluffy brush like this and we're going to just blend out the harsh line of this what we're going to do next is take a larger flat shader brush like this one and I am going you can use like any matte black that you have I'm going to go ahead and use my mineral eyeshadow by Bella Pierre this is called Noir and I'm putting just the tip of the brush in there tap that off I'm going to go into my outer V just using the tip of the brush just into my outer V like a fluffy flat brush like this I'm gonna go into another Bella Pierre mineral shadow this one is called Veruca it's a really pretty purple color with like a little bit of silver and gold shimmer in there what I'm gonna do is I'm going to put that over this black I'm just kind of blend that into my crease about two-thirds of the way in a small little flat top shader brush like this this one's from prescriptive I'm gonna go back into my coastal sense 88 palette and I'm gonna take that very last black you only need to lightly touch it because this black is so pigmented and what I'm gonna do with that is don't want to drop my palette you guys I'm going to just put that right into the corner of my eye and blend it in just slightly maybe a third of the way in and just into the crease I'm not going over the crease at all I'm going just into the crease with this brush like this and I am taking whatever highlight color you guys use I'm going to use this one it's called chestnut it's by Avon it looks a lot darker in pan than it comes out I'm just gonna put that the arch of my eyebrow and blend it down and out Gold mine by MAC. Just gonna touch the top of it with this brush. And I'm gonna stick that right into my tear duct here. It looks a lot like the camel color, but there's a lot more shimmer. And I'm gonna drag it down just a little bit on my lower lash. I'm going to line my tight line and really hope that my eye doesn't water. And then I'm going to go ahead and get my waterline. I'm going to go into a matte black. I'm not using either of the matte blacks that I used earlier for my outer V. This is by L'Oreal and it's called Lush Raven. And I'm just going to use this to set 
that eyeliner that I put into my waterline. Now I'm going to do, I'm going to take a concealer that is about three shaders lighter than my complexion, than my foundation. And I'm just going to put some of it onto um, a foundation brush like this. And I'm going to just push that in under my eyes and clean up any fallout that I may have got. And I'm going to take Gel Liner by Maybelline Eye Studio. This is in Black is Black. Take an eyeliner brush. Really saturate the head, the tip. And we're going to start out doing just a regular winged eyeliner. We're going to go right up under that wing and do like a thinner wing. And bring that down into the second half of your lower lash line so that you get that smudged out look. Mascara to my top lashes. And I'm going to really get those bottom lashes that on the middle first oh, oh. technical difficulties go ahead and pull the front down and lay that down and then pull the end. And just make sure that everything is really set on there good. Tracy loves her contour, y'all. Um, I will do a contour video for you guys. For those of you who aren't quite sure how or what to do when it comes to contouring. Okay. She likes her bronzer too, but um, I'm not really a bronzer kind of girl. The um, blush that I used is by CoverGirl and it is called Plumberry Glow. No, yes, Plumberry Glow. And it looks like this. Same powder that I used to, for my eye. I'm going to set that under eye concealer. And at the same time, I'm going to use this as a highlight. And I went ahead and I did a really neutral lip. For neutral lip, you guys, you go for whatever is neutral to your skin. So what I did was I took this. It's called Petal. By NYC. I don't know if you guys can see that. I hope you can. Show you what it looks like though. It is just this pretty pink here. And I lined my lips with some dark brown liner. And I glossed with a Quiet Roar by MAC. Hope you guys can see that. Quiet Roar, MAC. Just this. Because Tracy does a really dramatic makeup all around. And then she does like a really neutral lip. So put on your gaudy Jersey Licious jewelry, which I'm not wearing, not being into like accessories too much. And um, you can be Tracy for the night, for the night. I'm sorry. It's late. I'm getting a little delirious. Anywho, here is the final eye look. I really hope you guys like it. My smoked out. I, a la Tracy from Jersey Delicious. And I will see you dolls and gems soon, hopefully. As always, peace, love. Come back and see me again.